not on our time. Sharon Osbourne is speaking out about the crasher she literally kicked off the stage at the People's Choice Awards. He chose the wrong time to do it. And the wrong people to do it to. <laughs> we caught up with the ladies backstage at their show where the crasher was the topic of the day. If I see him again, I'd kick him again. <laughs> The crasher grabbed the mic as the ladies were accepting the award for favorite daytime TV hosting. They were like a motley crew. Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. My name is Ricardo Castillo. Shout out to Kevin Gates. Is the album. Uh -uh. You jumped over the jump, man. Yes, sir. Cheryl Underwood grabbed the mic and then Sharon kicked the guy twice. There was a moment, though, up there where I was like, oh, is this dangerous? There was like a second. And then my bodyguards took over. By the way, Yeezy Jumped Over the Jumpman is a lyric from Kanye West's new song. You'll recall how Kanye famously crashed the stage during Taylor Swift's big moment at the 2009 VMAs. I'm let you finish. I caught up with the rude dude today. His name is Zakari Nicasio, a 20 year old aspiring musician. Can you understand why the ladies on stage would have been one, offended, and two, frightened? Nope. You, you, come on, really? Nicasio was briefly handcuffed by the LAPD backstage, but was released without being charged. While the incident may be amusing to some, a stage crasher at a live TV event is troubling. With the Golden Globes set to take place this Sunday at the Beverly Hilton Hotel, you can be sure that event organizers will be carefully reviewing their security measures. This could have been a very, very serious episode. Had this individual been armed, for example, or wearing an explosive vest, could have been devastating, could have been overwhelming.